morning welcome to day three in new york it's the fourth vlog so it's the penultimate day of our trip um we've got a busy day planned already it is eight in the morning mm -hmm. we've been up really early the, the whole few days we've been here we've been waking up at like half five haven't we and just sort of getting up getting ready to start our day because there's so much to do um we're tired in the evening but in the morning we're sort of like wide awake ready and raring to go so so today is no different so it's like eight o'clock we're ready we're gonna go out first stop of the morning is gonna be the illusion museum i think we're gonna not have breakfast today we're just gonna grab a coffee maybe a pastry or something i'm not gonna have a big breakfast because we want to have a nice lunch um over at staten island so yeah illusion museum staten island ferry some shopping and let's see where else the day takes us. Every change has a reason. Baby. Oh, it is fresh this morning. It's very chilly, but sunny at the same time. That's why I've got my sunglasses on. I'm not extra. It's sunny. Is where we are going to the Museum of Illusion, which is in this building here. This big building, I don't know if I can vlog in there, I'm not sure because you know, illusions. But if I can, I can, but if I can't, I can't. Oh my god. I just put my camera in there. <gasps> oh my god, that's so trippy. <gasps> put your head right in. <laughs> that is weird. <laughs> There's like a hundred of you. There's only one of me. It's a square, it's a triangle, it's a square, it's a triangle. The infinity room, after, after you, after. There's so many of us. Dizziness may occur. Whoa. Oh my god, it feels like we're moving. <laughs> this is so. I was able to vlog in there so yeah that is the museum of illusion that was something different wasn't it i enjoyed that right should we go brave it to the staten island ferry yep in the cold it's gonna be freezing let's go
actually, is it? Yeah, you're at the back. Just yeah, I thought it'd be like much hint. colder than this. But Statue of Liberty's just coming up. There she is. There she is. Zoom in. Square to do a little bit of shopping. We've got Nordstrom Rack over there, Drain Reed, there's Mac Forever 21, there's Bath and Body Works somewhere, somewhere around here. We've got to find it. <laughs> Basically, if you want some good discounted shopping, come to Union Square. Um, I'm going to spend a lot of time in Nordstrom Rack, I reckon. So let, let's get go. Well, there's trainers in there. Yeah, 10 minutes in and out. <laughs> let's go. Anyway, right let's go. Let's go. Okay, let's go and see what goodies we can get in here. This is definitely the place to come if you want some designer handbags at a fraction of the price of this Kate Spade bag. Oh, if we can get the tag, hang on a minute. It is only $89, $90. There's one here, I think, that's 60 is there one here that's 60? Kate Spade bag? Yeah, $64. Cheap, cheap as chips. I don't, I don't need a handbag though. I've got plenty. We've got naked palettes in here. Naked smoky palette. It's $24. That's so good. So they've got a designer shoe section here. It's called Designer Row. And they've got them in sizes. So you've got all of the designer shoes. Um, these Jimmy Poos, yeah, Jimmy Choos. Um, oh, it's out of focus. Hang on. There we go. Look at that green. So nice. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't wear these. They're too high, to be honest. But they're nice. They're really nice, and they are uh, two hundred and twenty-nine dollars. What a bargain! What is it? It is a bargain if you're after a designer shoe. But I don't really do designer shoes what well, I do flat shoes flat designer shoes but not massive heeled shoes but I just wanted to have a look down here just because I'm nosy reverse reverse Can't see. well that was a successful shop in Nordstrom Rack I will show you what I got when we go back to the hotel room Chris bought nothing he was going to get a pair of trainers and then he decided he wasn't going to. What's going on? Didn't like me. Are you feeling alright? Yeah, didn't like me. Yeah. <laughs> so we have finished shopping and we're on our way back to the hotel and we've stopped off at Carlos Bakery. If you didn't know, Carlos is Cake Boss. There he is, over there. And we've come here to buy a t shirt for my brother because if you didn't know, my brother bakes amazing cakes. And so I thought it was pretty fitting if I got him some merch. But can we just appreciate all of these amazing caves? Wow. I mean, I mean, we may buy a cake to eat now as well. Maybe. Cannoli. You want a cannoli? Oh, wow. And we're back in the hotel room. And look. Literally just got back. It's snowing. We timed that well, actually. Although, I kind of feel like I want to be out in the snow. I'll tell you what, though, you can't see a thing. Look how foggy it is down there. Yeah, because you can see all the way to Central Park from here already. Wow, look. <laughs> New York in the snow. It's literally been five minutes since I last filmed that clip, and it's settling. Look at the roofs. That's a lot of snow. Car parks. There is a lot of snowfall in a matter of minutes. Look at the paths. Oh God. We're supposed to be going to the top of the Rockefeller tonight. Um, well, they did say it's going to reach about six-ish, hopefully. Hmm. Let's monitor this, shall we? We may change our plans. <laughs> so we were supposed to go to the top of the rock for our final evening, but we've decided to just stay around Times Square area just to stay close because the weather is 
yeah the weather is really really cold it's like minus it would be 12 up there. yeah so we've done it before um we did it last time we came two yeah. three years ago um so it's a shame that we're not doing it tonight but we're just going to stay in the local area go and have some nice dinner i've put a nice leopard print brow br brows blouse on chris has got look look at his shirt it's got cocktails on hmm. we would go for cocktails couldn't we we'd go for a drink in times square yeah at least yeah to finish off our um our trip it's like last night to be honest it's probably a good thing that we're staying in the local area because we need to pack our case tonight and stuff and i will show you the bits and bobs that i bought from nordstrom rack cvs um i'll probably buy some more bits actually when i'm in times square because i need to buy a couple more gifty bits um so i'll show you all that when i get back anyway right let's go and find somewhere nice for dinner have a drink and finish off our final evening so this is technically our first meal of the day we haven't had any meals today have we? we haven't been out for breakfast haven't been out for lunch but as you just grabbed things didn't we yeah this is our first meal we've come to a place called uh ruby i haven't got the menu ruby tuesdays uh, in times square it's basically like a harvester because they've got like grills and ribs and steaks and um <laughs> yeah and they've got over there they've got like a salad bar so it's like a harvester if you're from the uk <laughs> um but yeah we're coming here because it's freezing outside absolutely freezing so we wanted some yummy food to warm us up so i went for bourbon chicken with mashed potato and broccoli and chris has got steak He's gonna have steak for breakfast as well, aren't you? <laughs> I've got a Long Island iced tea, which is the strongest Long Island iced tea I think I've ever had. I think it's just pure alcohol. Tidy for money. <laughs> and Chris has got, have you got? Just beer. Do you know what beer it is? Coors Light. Oh, Coors Light. Six dollars. Boom. Right, anyway, I'm gonna eat my food, otherwise it's gonna get cold. So we are now back in the room. We've actually been back a good couple of hours. Uh, we've been packing our case ready to go tomorrow. Um, our flight isn't until nine o'clock at night, so we still have a couple of things to fit in tomorrow morning. Um, and then we're gonna head to the airport around four o'clock. So there'll still be another vlog after this, um, but we didn't really do a great deal after dinner. Had a couple of drinks, came back to the room, packed our case. I know I mentioned that I was going to show you the bits and bobs that I bought today, but they're all packed away, so I will do that in the next vlog. Uh, so the next vlog will be, um, I think we're going to go back to Central Park tomorrow, go to the plaza, I'm going to go to the Rockefeller, hopefully. Like I say, we didn't go tonight, it was just too cold. It's going to be even colder tomorrow, um, but we are going to brave it. <laughs> um, we just didn't want to do it at night. We've been walking around all day and we just thought, Oh, no, let's just stay in the local area so we're going to venture over to Rockefeller um, tomorrow so that'll be in the next vlog um, but yeah anyway I'm going to love you and leave you for today um, I'm just running myself a radioactive bath it looks like a raspberry slush puppy has melted in my bath um, but yeah I'm going to hop in there take all the makeup off and um, try and get a decent night's sleep because we're going to be up bright and early again tomorrow so um, yeah look out for the next vlog so I hope you've enjoyed today and I'll see you next week for the final New York vlog I'll see you then bye Start spreading the news I'm leaving today